Hello everyone. I'm your teacher Alex Piulet and welcome to Consumer Electronics Servicing Class. In this video, I will discuss to you the basic electronic schematic symbols of the different electronic components and devices used in electronic appliances. But before that, please do consider to like and subscribe and watch this video till the end. Now, here are the basic electronic schematic symbols. First, we have the resistor. It is a component used to limit or reduce current flow and adjust signal levels. It has two types. First is the fixed resistor. And this is the actual appearance and the symbol. Second is the variable resistor. And this is the actual appearance. And sometimes we call this as the volume control. And this is the symbol. Next, we have the capacitor. A device that stores electrical energy. A capacitor has two types also. First, the fixed capacitor. And this is the actual appearance. And the symbol. Second, is the variable capacitor. And this is the actual appearance and the symbol. Next, we have the diode. The function or use of this component in a circuit depends on its type. A rectifier diode is a semiconductor device that converts alternating current to the direct current. And this is the actual appearance and the symbol. A Zener diode allows the current to flow backwards and this is the actual appearance and the symbol the LED or light emitting diode emits light when current flows through it and this is the actual appearance and the symbol this component usually used and found in a remote control of our television and radio sets Another component is the transistor, a semiconductor device used to amplify or switch signals and electrical power. It has two types, the NPN or negative positive negative transistor and this is the symbol. The arrow is pointing outside of the component, while the PNP or Positive negative positive transistor, the arrow in the symbol is pointing inside of the component. Next, we have the transformer, a device that transfers electrical energy from one alternating current circuit to one or more other circuits, either increasing or stepping up or reducing, stepping down the voltage. The difference of these two types is, in the step-up transformer, the primary winding is lower than the secondary winding, while in the step-down transformer, the primary winding is higher than the secondary winding. Next, we have the speaker, a device used to convert electrical signal to sound signal. That's why we hear sound or music in our television and radio sets. And the symbol for a speaker is like this. Next, we have the fuse. A safety device that protects the circuit from excessive electric current. And this is the actual appearance usually used in our appliances. And this is the symbol. Then we have the antenna, a device used to transmit or receive radio or television signals. Every radio or television has an antenna. That's why 
we receive signals from the different television channels and radio stations. And this is the symbol. We have also the switch, a device used to connect or disconnect the circuit. We use this to turn on or turn off our appliances. And this is the symbol. We have also the mail plug, a device with two or three pins that is inserted in a socket to make an electrical connection. Or we use this device to plug in or connect our appliances in the outlet. And this is the symbol. We have also the cell. A single unit which converts chemical energy to electrical energy. We use this usually in our remote control of our appliances. And this is the symbol. Next, we have the battery. This consists of a group of cells. We use this in our appliances that needs or requires higher voltage. We usually use also in our car and this is the symbol then we have also the conductor or wire a device used to connect the component in a circuit and this is the symbol for a single wire now when two or more wires are connected the symbol is like this if two wires are joined but not connected the symbol is like this. And lastly, we have the ground or earth. Most of our appliances, especially our refrigerator and power tools and equipment has a wire which is usually connected to the ground. And these are the symbol for ground. So, that's it. I hope you learned something in this video. Now if you want to know more about the uses and functions of the different electronic components and devices, please watch this. Thank you very much for watching. Again, please like and share this video. And don't forget to click the subscribe button. Bye!